Time to see what's trending now with online media producer Bianca Cervantes. She's in the News Center with more. It's politics and animals today brewing on trending now, and it looks like Facebook is one of the social media catalysts for the Republican National Convention in Florida. Let's take a look. About this time in 2008, Facebook marked the 100 million user milestone. In 2012, they're closing in on 1 billion users worldwide. We now have more people on Facebook in the United States than there were registered voters in 2008. It's no surprise they have a presence at the Republican National Convention. Facebook has a dedicated U.S. politics hub and recently unveiled the I'm Voting app with CNN. Here, friends can see who stands where on the issues, among other things, and how the political landscape is shaping up. And caught on camera, a bull makes a break for it at a fair in Pennsylvania. Now, this injured several fairgoers in the process. He got loose Friday night. Ten people were reported to be injured. One of those, an elderly woman, hit her head after being knocked from her chair by the bull. She was airlifted to a hospital. None of the other injuries, however, were believed to be serious. And a group of teens comes face to face with an alligator. The alligator was minding his own business and the teens decided not to. They say they spotted the gator along a rural road in Tuttle, Oklahoma. The creature was hiding in a grassy area, most likely in search of food. The guys eventually wrestled the animal into submission. I'm the next crocodile Dundee, I guess. And keep up with trending politics and all of those crazy animal stories 24-7 using our mobile app. Type KTSM.com into your browser and download it for free. That's what's trending now for Tuesday in the News Center. Bianca Cervantes, News Channel 9. What an eeny little bitty alligator. All right, well, the Obama administration today...